Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy, I Take You Out Guy. Here with a video of um, data speeds. So, on the left is the Sony Xperia C4. On the right is the Nexus 6. I'm going to do a data speed test on the Project Phi, um, the data SIM card, and versus the main SIM card. Okay, so let's go ahead and give it a try. Now, this one only has T Mobile. This one has T-Mobile and Sprint, and actually this was on Sprint right now, so maybe we can see which one um, gets better speeds by doing that. And let's, let's go. Now with the data, only SIM card, um, basically is self-explanatory. You only have data on it, so you don't, you're not able to call uh, or text um, without the actual SIM card, but you, you can... You know, use Hangouts, text now, Skype. You you use all your apps and you know browse the web things and such, and watch videos and all types of things with the data only. But if you have the Project Five SIM card, the main one, you can um, turn off the data and still be able to call and text um, without worrying. So, oh wow, okay. <laughs> um, so the T-Mobile um, SIM card in the Project Five data only. Uh, it gave me right now. It gave me 17 megabytes and of downloads and one megabyte of upload. While Sprints gave me six megabytes downloads and two megabytes upload. So I'm gonna do another test again. Usually, got to try like three times to to get a better rate. And there they go at the races. Okay, as you see on the second second turn, sprints jumped up to from six to eighteen, so it jumped to twelve megabytes, and actually T-Mobile lost a couple megabytes on the uh, downloads, but it gained a it gained a megabyte in the upload, and so did the sprints, and that's pretty much it for that one. And one more try. Like I said, the one on the left is T-Mobile with Project 5 Data Only Sim. And the one on the right has T-Mobile and Sprint. So, right now, it, it just switched me to Sprint. I have no re I have no idea why, but that's what it did. So, now you know the data speeds. Okay, and in this round... Oh, wow. <laughs> that's crazy. Um... In this round, T-Mobile gain, it went up a little bit. And Sprint dropped for some reason. I have no idea why it dropped. But uh, yeah, now we're going to do Wi-Fi speeds. We're going to go ahead and do the Wi-Fi version of the data speeds and see what that gives us. All right, go back to the results. Now this is just on Wi-Fi. This is just what's, what, what I am averaging in my house. <laughs> it's not gonna be good, guys. <laughs> it's not gonna be good. If, if people know how, how much I was complaining about the Wi-Fi data speeds at home, yeah. That's why I prefer just to use my Project 5 speeds. But, yeah, it's not going to be good at all, as you can see. Yeah, very ugly. And, and, and there there is nothing in the house that's using the Wi-Fi at all. Maybe my laptop, but that shouldn't even kill it. Not even a megabyte on uploads. Not even a megabyte. All right, we're gonna do it again. We're gonna do it again, guys. <laughs> so 
So I hope you guys can see what you can get with Project Fi, uh, with Dead Speeds, with T-Mobile and Sprint, which one's better. Uh, it, it really depends on your coverage and, and then depends on the, er the area you live in uh, with Project Fi. So, I mean, a lot of people give us Sprint crap and, you know, all that, but it's pretty decent where I stay. It, as, as you can see, what the speeds was with my T-Mobile, it was almost neck and neck. And actually, in, in some cases, it, it, it gave a little better speed. So, yeah, there we go again. Three megabytes, not even a megabyte on uploads. We're going to do it one more time for the Wi-Fi, and then that's it. That's the end of the show. <laughs> and this is just data speeds between the Project 5 SIM card um, versus the Project 5 data-only SIM card with the Nexus 6 and the Sony Xperia C4. I hope you guys enjoyed the um, video. Hope this was very informative. Let you know what to expect between these um, two different devices and SIM cards and networks. So, yep. And if you're in my area, don't get AT&T. <laughs> That's all I got to say. But yeah, this crazy. Yep. All right, guys. Um, Final results. I'll say on average... Um, on average, they're pretty much neck and neck, about three megabytes um, download speeds and half a megabyte, 500 kilobytes of upload. So there you guys have it. Um, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. This is your boy, I'll take you, I guy. Hope you enjoy the video.